In this video we will show you how to change a universal access point operational mode for local management. Firstly, ensure that you have an Extreme Cloud IQ account. Note that it is free to set up an account if you do not already have one. The free of charge, entry-level Connect license is sufficient for the Universal Access Point operational mode change process. You should check that your access points are above the required minimum serial number to support on-premises operation. The illustration on screen shows the required minimum serial number details. Extreme Cloud IQ will validate model and serial number compatibility for operational mode change during the onboarding process. Select the onboard menu. Then deploy your devices locally. Hit Let's Get Started. Enter access point serial number and hit onboard device. Note the device OS has been set to wing, as deploy your devices locally was previously selected. Note both individual and bulk CSV import options are available. This video shows the individual method. The CSV option will be more convenient for a large number of devices. Once your device is onboarded and connected, the access point reboots into Wing OS and uses on-premise discovery options to adopt to either a Wing controller or Extreme Campus controller. Previously onboarded universal access points can also have operational mode changed by selecting the device and selecting Change OS to Wing under the Actions menu. Once adopted to the Wing controller or Extreme Campus controller, these can be connected to Extreme Cloud IQ to provide statistics, metrics and associated user data visibility in Extreme Cloud IQ. If in the future you wish to revert your devices to native Extreme Cloud IQ operation then this can be achieved through the device management. More details available in the article in link at code shown. For more information you can select the question mark icon to access context sensitive help or refer to extremenetworks.com. Look out for more videos on our YouTube channel. Please subscribe to receive updates on additional how-to videos like this. Thank you for watching.